sewer excavation requirements, we have a two foot eight inch excavation right at that dot. What it's gonna show is that we have a four inch lateral connecting into a possible eight inch main cast iron sewer line. Again, at two feet, eight inches. Please note that there's a big chance that two feet out of that two foot eight inches is all concrete. With that being said, we're gonna need a concrete saw to do a perfect cut and a air compressor jackhammer to go all the way down. So in order to do this effectively, we're gonna to have to do this about a three foot long excavation by about no less than two feet wide and then we go straight down. It's gonna be a tight hole, but it'll be as small as we can get it in order to reach the four inch pipe and either cut a small section, remove it, and then clean up the liner from the inside of the four inch pipe, or we actually replace the Y from the eight inch to the four inch, which means we'll have to go upward and downward some more with the concrete. Let's try to service it first from the four inch and see if we can get that liner cleaned up from that four inch pipe. If that works, then we go ahead and bring in some gravel and then start the concrete installation with reinforcement rebar. That's what we got.